record. And then go. Namecube.com is the registrar. I don't know. You're familiar with this one or not? What is this? Oh, it's Namesheep. Um, I'm unfamiliar with Namesheep. Not super. I only know GoDaddy. It's not super different. I got some there. So you go into Namesheep, uh -huh. log in, you get your list of domains. How many domains would be allowed if I owned a lot of domains? How many should, like, what do you think is the limit? No, what do you think is a lot? How many do you Um, 10. Well, I have more than 10. I have a lot. Okay. I believe you. I want one of them for S-Y-R-A-I. Manage is the button on the right. And then we go to advanced DNS. This is the part where it's like GoDaddy, I think, from this point. You should be mm -hmm. comfortable. You see the... Familiar. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Okay. So if we change the host on all these, which are currently A records, to old, that's going to mean what's the current Squarespace hosted mm -hmm. will go to old.syrai. Now we need your participation in ready mag world to guide me to yeah. the promised land. Yes. All right, so you log in. Are there two? It's odd. You added two. Um all right, so you're gonna go to syr.ai. Mm-hmm. Um, and the site, it's already published, so once that loads. Once it loads. Okay, then you're going to go to the lower right-hand side. You see the little toggle next to the question mark, the little menu next to the question mark on the left? Yeah, click on that. And then you're going to go to domain. Mm -hmm. And then, yep, there's that. Then it'll, it'll tell you what you need to know after you put it in. Bingo. There you go. Very simple. There's our Very answer. Simple. There's our app. There's our IP. We go to the next one, which was a TXT. Mm -hmm. That's sweet. You feel the What is that? Value. Why does that keep happening? Oh. Good. We are now step away. We got to do this one. The old. These are all for domains. These are. Mm -hmm. Records. Once you do the verification text record, you don't need it twice. You can delete those. Just clean up your records whenever you're in. Uh -huh. It's a one time check that'll keep using them. C names are more permanent. Mm. This one, though, is verify. Again, once it's verified, it's not a big deal. You don't have to do anything on the Squarespace side. At the point where it's here with the domain name yeah. records and when oh, I see. in uh, Squarespace, mm -hmm. they're not aligned, right? Because it was www okay. and you're married, you know, it was at the root anyway, right? So mm -hmm. we go to that site in Squarespace. We go to uh, settings. And go to the mains. We have DNS error over here. Look at that. You can verify DNS settings with Namecheap. And we can disconnect this domain. And then we can use the domain that I own. And we can type in old.syr.ai. 
Venture domains are not supported. Connect domain, yeah, got it. Yeah. We'll do this quick verify. Where'd I go? The wizard Namecheap. That's Namecheap. Do you remember how to get there, Namecheap? To the DNS? Yep. Uh, domains. What is that? We're at domains. We're at. Uh... Yeah, I think my little face. It was, I just needed to move my little zoom. Mm -hmm. All right, what's next? Uh, manage. Manage, correct. What's next? After yes. Manage? Advanced DNS. Okay. Yeah. And then we do the C name to get verify. What was it? Uh, C name host is that, and then it's verified at squarespace.com. So. Cool, cool, cool. Yep. Stop sharing. We just did the mains. How do we feel? Good. I mean, you walked.